How to cheaply and easily ship your motorcycle suspension. Let's go for a ride. You are watching Cycle Cruises all on one motorcycle channel. Subscribe today. If you haven't seen my suspension removal video, I'll include a video link in the description and comment section below. Uh, for those of you that want to have your suspension service or rebuilt, which I'm getting ready to have mine rebuilt uh, and revalved by GoRace.com. Uh, just because the OEM suspension on my WR250R is not the greatest. Um, so what's awesome with the WR250R suspension though is that you can upgrade it and it will be absolutely awesome at a cost of course. Uh, but the shop I'm sending to GoRace.com is out in Virginia so I have to ship my suspension there and I'm just going to show you a, a very cheap and easy way to send it now I know some of you guys will send it in a rifle case which a rifle case can be rather expensive to buy anywhere from like uh, 70 to 100 plus dollars and then if you take it to UPS uh, they charge I think $11 fee to inspect the gun case that doesn't even include the, the shipping fee Note, another reason to avoid a gun case is because they're more prone to getting stolen during shipping. And of course, a gun case is going to add a lot more weight, so you're going to pay more for shipping. So I found a very cheap way. I found an old 37-inch LED TV box up in my attic that will work absolutely perfect. I wrapped it in bubble wrap, which by the way, I'll include a video, excuse me, I'll include a link to where you can buy the bubble wrap there. Fairly inexpensive. Um, basically you just wrap the the forks and the shock with the bubble tape I double wrapped it uh, taped it up with shipping tape and then of course I took the the styrofoam that was inside of the LED box which by the way you could probably procure one of these like 37 inch TV boxes maybe if you call Best Buy or call your local stores and ask them do they have any any extra TV boxes of this size you know anywhere from 40 inches um, you know, 37 to 40, 37 it fits absolutely perfect. But as you can see, I put the styrofoam on the bottom there. So I'm going to take the shock and I'll put that down here. There. So it's kind of held up by the styrofoam, which will provide some protection. And then we'll go ahead and put the fork down here. Okay, then I got the other styrofoam pieces that were inside. I'm going to put that in here to separate it. So that way they're not banging on each other. Even though it has bubble wrap, but still this will help, help it keep it even a bit safer. And then I have here some of this bubble stuff in here to kind of keep it from shifting around inside. You can use any type of stuffing though. See, this stuff is great here. I, I saved this from when I get Amazon shipments. So I didn't buy this. So I can't provide a link to where you can get it. <laughs> but see that? And it's very lightweight and that provides some extra protection, you know. Go ahead, tape this up. Okay, and the weight is approximately 35 pounds. Take it down to the UPS center. Make sure to insure it for at least, I don't know, I'm probably insured for like $1,500 or $2,000. It cost me $45 to ship, and that's with $1,500 insurance. As far as suspension servicing intervals, for street bikes, you want to change the fork and shock oil at least every 10,000 miles or less. And if your shock doesn't have oil and just gas, you want to have that service as well at 10,000 miles or less. And of course, dirt bikes and dual sports require more frequent servicing. And if you don't want to do the servicing, you can have the experts like at GoRace.com do it for you. For those of you guys that want to get my motorcycle gear, you know, my camel pants, my helmet, gloves, cameras, everything. I always include links in the description and comment section of my videos. Or go to my website at cyclecruiser.com and click on the menu tab, My Gear. And those are current links to all of my stuff. 
And if you want to see more of my videos, click on the menu tab, My Videos. And those are a bunch of playlists with my over 1,100 plus videos. And one of those playlists is called How To's. So I hope that helps you out. Hey, hit thumbs up if you like this video. I hope this video helps you guys out. Uh, share this video with your friends. But anyways, guys, also go check out my other channel, Bug Out Moto. The showcase is a van that I customize for cheap that allows me to live in my van with my motorcycle anywhere and has a ton of cool mods. And that channel has everything from build videos, trip videos, uh, anything and everything Bug Out Moto. As a courtesy, I included two video playlists, one for new riders, and those are all of the videos I've done over the years that I feel are helpful for new riders, and also my popular videos playlist. Hey, hit the subscribe button. I appreciate it. Take care.